Hello, 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 and welcome back to Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Today we're doing a, uh, I guess a kind of a steel or metal coat theme. Uh, this was uh, mentioned by, uh, let's see, Cryoxerxes, I believe it is. They had said that uh, Sizer is their favorite Pokemon and um, that they'd like to see some Pokemon themed around that or some fusions themed around that. So we're going to do like kind of that. Uh, there's not a lot of Pokemon that actually evolve with Metal Coat, apparently. Didn't know that. Uh, that's some knowledge that I should have known, but I don't. So we're going to kind of fuse Steelix and Sizor with some other Pokemon. And then I've got I've got about halfway in. We got a little... Well, maybe more than less than half more. We got a little something else I'm gonna I, I kind of thrown together. So we're gonna try that. All right, let's start with not moving them. We want to fuse them. Fusing of their pre prevo. Maybe they'll be like less. Ooh, I was gonna say maybe they'll be like less metal now when you mix in their their pre pre metalized forms. Should probably speed that up a little. Oh, he gets sore. <laughs> That's actually really cool. Or are they like long shears? I think they look more like swords to me. Because that's what you get when you mix. Um... Oh, it even comes in the green color. You know, I got to say. Ooh, that's actually a really cool one, too. It's, it's kind of like red Scyther. If Scyther didn't get these claws. Oh, my God. There are so many cool ones. <laughs> this is wait is this yeah this is almost exactly the same just better like well better obviously it's the same concept I like these a lot all of these are really cool uh this one's my favorite right now though the swords my my deal about sizer was that's also really cool okay can't choose I'm gonna have to pick the I, I kind of like the green my biggest issue with Scyther is how red it was. It just, when I was young, I didn't love it, I guess, Scyther. Um, I, I, for some reason, I associated it, for some reason, I associated it with a lobster. <laughs> for some crazy reason. But uh, it's the big red pincers. I just, I assumed it was like a, supposed to be some kind of lobster. I never understood it. <laughs> that was a little bit more creepy. Ooh, that's more like... Oh, that's cool. Uh, it, this one is more... Uh... Organic pincer. This one is upsetting. This one also... Wow, actually. Oh my god, they have some really cool Scyther fusion. We need to sit down and do like... A, a, just a full-on Scyther run. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Wait, what's with the... What's with the doopy eyes on it? <laughs> I love those doofy eyes, though. Um, I think this one, though. This one, absolutely, I love. I love those. They look like they're digging implements for digging rather than cutting, which kind of d destroys the purpose of uh, Scyther. <laughs> Scythers weren't never meant to cut. Okay, let's go ahead and do the Prevo with Steelix. Oh, we've already seen these. Okay. This is sad. <laughs> I mean, not the, not the fusion. I don't know if either of these are actually custom, but this is sad that this is something I've already seen. I think I've seen these in um, the run. So if if you guys want to see those, watch the whole series. Yeah, like all 140 something videos. Because it happened. And I could use the watch. No, don't, don't. Don't feel inclined. Only if you really want to see Steelix and Onyx. Okay, so let's go ahead and fuse the two Metal Coat Pokemon together. Get this one straight out of the... Oh my god. Straight out of the... Oh, they're so cool. Both of them look very cool. I don't know which one to start with. Uh, get it straight out of the box. <laughs> what? Um, what happened here? It's more steel than it ever has been in the past. It looks like um, a little robot dude. 
I like him. He's my friend. Okay, let's take a look at the other one. He's such a friend shape, though, isn't it? Oh, God. That is really unexpected. I like this a lot. Look at the wings. Oh, God. I like this a lot. I wasn't expecting the red and black. Damn. Damn. Once again, this is, it's got that same vibe, the same energy, but just without the black. I think I prefer the black colors on it. It, it adds like a nice differentiation. Like it's more bulky, ready to, ready for a brawl. The Iron Pincer Pokemon. Uh, so moving forward, moving forward here, I think we are going to kind of pick and choose some of these guys. Uh, all of them is going to see at least one fusion here with uh, Steelix or, 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 I was going to say Pinsir. Have I been saying Pinsir this whole time? Sizor. Scizor? I may be having a goddamn stroke. Oh my god, that is amazingly cool looking. The silhouette is so cool. Both of them. One looks really top heavy and the other one looks uh, bottom heavy. Like a, like a, one got half the body and, well, oh God, I can't even talk. Ooh, that is, oh God, the fucking jaw. <laughs> the mouth on the chest is not fun. But everything else about this is super cool. I like that it got like pincer arm, or not pincer. God damn, have I been doing that entire time? Sizer armor. That's really cool. Okay, now, now I'm really excited to see the other one with a quick reversal. This one looks like it's got like the mega horns. Oh God, I wasn't expecting it to look like this. I was expecting more sizor shape rather than pincer shape. <laughs> oh God, that is hilarious. God, he's got more. <laughs> I love it. Oh my god, I love it. I Okay, well I guess I'm picking that one. I was going to say I can't pick between the jaw and not the jaw. All right, let's take a look at Beedrill. I'm kind of going down the bugs first. First, first. First the bugs come and then the plagues or something. I don't know. I don't know my my lore. These uh I chose these two because they're both very similar shape. Oh my god, that is actually makes so much sense it's just it flows just perfectly oh man i love this <laughs> okay i might be wrong but is this is this uh best uh um oh god i can't even remember its name beetle ah beetlemon or <laughs> not beetlemon <laughs> fuck oh my god Tiger something mon. Uh, Sting mon. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I I think this, I, I thought this was like Tiger V mon or V mon. I can call it V mon. Tiger B mon, but I don't think that's actually what that is. I had to look up Tiger B mon to remember. It looks uh, a little too different. This might be something else that I'm not aware of, of a reference. But uh, my man Sting mon's here. I had to go with Sting mon. It's that other one, super cool. But come on, Stingmon. All right, let's take a reversal. See what this this badass is. He's got like weird little oh. <laughs> he's, I was gonna say he's got like the Luke those little tiny hook feet that um Beedrill have. <laughs> oh, he's kind of cute though. He's kind of got like a cute I'm gonna kick your ass vibe, but he's adorable when he does it, right? He's like, yeah, like when a spider is like raising its forearms at you, you know, it's unsettling and creepy, but it's kind of cute in a way, right? Some, please somebody else. I'm not, I'm not crazy. <laughs> All right, we're going to go ahead and do the rock types real quick. Refuse, uh, I wait, I brought two. Okay, no, wait. Oh, that's right. Golurk is a ground type. I was going to say, I thought I had more rock types than that, but I don't. Okay, we're just gonna see what this would be if Golurk got himself some metal coat. 
Uh... Okay. <laughs> he turns into a horrible monster. Oh god, that cannot be fun to move around. Right? That's that's gotta be painful to exist. Ooh, the cracking noise it made. <laughs> I don't know if this this is a uh, you know what? This is probably a better existence. Oh my god, that's so funny. I was I, I actually forgot that uh there is the metal type Geodude, isn't there? Or did I make that up? Did I make that up? Did I dream of this guy? He's got like a taser on his back, right? Oh well. Uh, let's see a few more of both of these. God, why? Why do I need to do this? Okay. Uh, Golar. Oh, I like it. I was kind of afraid that a lot of these were going to turn into like robots or something like that, but you know, we'll find out. Oh, I love his little Golurk face. He's cute. I feel like this would be, this could be a, a really fun construction construct for uh, Steelix. Oh, wow. This guy feels like something you'd face in a, like an RPG kind of game. <laughs> What's with the face here? <laughs> I'm liking these. Oh, uh, what is this? What's happening here? I'm, I'm so confused. Oh, 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 I see. It's a seal. The seal on the chest. I thought the chest opened and his head fell off or something. They're both by the same person, so I kind of assume they were just like variations. Okay. <laughs> That's cool, though. I like those. I like all of those. That was actually really cool. I kind of forget Steelix was a Pokemon, to be honest with you. It's, it's, I don't know why. Uh, he, I just never loved Steelix as much as other Pokemon. All right, let's try Middle Tank. Oh no, I can already. Please don't turn that chin into nipples. Oh, they didn't. They didn't do it. Oh, but they made it really. Why is he all milk? What? What part? What part of Steelix insisted that it needed to be a milk? Milix live even further underground than Onyx. Its sweet milk is enjoyed by children and grown-ups alike. People who don't drink milk turn into yogurt and eat it. Whoa, my God, I read that wrong. <laughs> I was about to say this Pokemon's fucking cursed. <laughs> People who don't drink its milk get turned into yogurt. Fuck me. People who don't drink milk turn it into yogurt and eat it. That's actually kind of sad on this Pokemon as well. They turned this Pokemon into yogurt. Ooh, that would be a nice evolution, though. It goes from, like, a big milky guy to a big pile of yogurt. I actually want some yogurt now. All right, Mr. Mushroom Man, I know you recently had a video, but let's see what you can turn into. Oh, ooh, that's a... That's an intimidating face you got there. But it also is like the face of someone who looks intimidating, but they're probably not that bad. I just saw all the legs. Never mind. It's a monster. My brain tuned it out and it finally came on through. Bright and clear. Excellent. All right. Let's see the reversal here. Ooh, that is pretty cool. I love the white color. Like the ghostly red eye or ghostly red eye the ghostly uh pale coloration and the red eyes that is really cool and it's got the steel beam or uh or chunks of rock coming out the back all right let's see a couple more uh S S steelix scyther S oh my god scissor I, there's too many oh oh no is this gonna be a cheerleader again oh, we've seen a lot of cheerleaders with jinx 
And it looks like it has that cheerleader pose. Oh my god! <laughs> um... I don't know how I feel about this. I need to... I need to have a moment to think. Alright, it's only right that we take a look at Gardevoir 2. Ooh! These don't look as, um... How do I put this? Extreme as the last one. Oh! <laughs> Sides are in a dress! You know what? I don't hate it. Ooh, it has like a nice pearl, per, pearl, adescent, pearl, adescent, per, pearl, pearly look to it. I like that. I don't hate it though. All right, let's see what this one is. Ooh, that is actually pretty cool. Okay, I like it. I'm into it. That's got. It's got like a nice. Um. I almost wish that the 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 the. The cloth part was more of a uh, side trim instead of an actual like skirt that opened up, but that's really cool. Oh wow, look at that! Oh wait, 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 wait! I know this. I know this reference. Um, Little Red Riding Hood. Fuck, I can't remember what that was called. Uh, sure. <laughs> I can't remember what that was called. I'm sorry. I thought I knew it. Okay, let's take a look at Golurk real quick. Oh my god, look at those pincers on this son of a gun. That one looks like he could do some damage. Oh, I love I love the designs on it. Like the um the Golurk. Like, whoa. This is exactly wait a minute. Okay. So I didn't include it because we've seen this in a in a video before. But this is the exact pose of another Pokemon that we've used. Um why not? Give me one second and I'll just show it off real quick. That's just double Scyther, right? Recolored with that. Um Does Scyther ha or Scyzor? Oh my god. Does Scyzor have a mega? Is that his mega form? I, I didn't... I wasn't super into, like, the Mega Form evolution or Mega Evolution stuff. So I didn't really keep too track of it. All right, let's see what this one makes. Okay, it makes nothing. I'm actually a little happy about... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. These look really cool. I love when they have, like, really, like, drastic... Oh, my God. That is fucking amazing. Uh, that is so fucking. <laughs> I love this too. I'm not gonna lie to you. I love this one just as much. <laughs> All right. All right. Reversal time. What do you got for us? Show us something great. Ooh. That's kind of like that other one we saw, but I don't know if I love the coloration on it. It makes me think of an ice cream. Oh, that's that's a little bit more. Yeah, they did different colors. Oh, I really like this blue. I don't know why this makes me think of ice cream. Like, I guess the brown, the white, and like the, uh, the gray, the brown... It's ice cream. I'm sorry. I kind of like this brown one, too. Uh, I really like the blue one, though. It looks like it's kind of like the... What What was that? The Crystal Onyx Pokemon? It makes me think of that, so I like that a lot. Okay, so we didn't see Miltank and Scizor. I got it right this time. Oh, no. I can already see the little speckles of paint. Oh, no. Its wings are going to be pa paint. Milk. Its wings are going to be milk. I wish it was paint. Oh, man. I want to live in that world. Oh, oh no. Is the... Okay, wait. I think it has full... No, it's cheese! <laughs> I, I was so focused on the wings. I overlooked the cheese wheel. <laughs> oh, who did this to you? 
<laughs> Fuck, that's so good. All right, so now we're gonna take a look at these three of these guys. Uh, I kind of, oh, we, oh, we've already seen one of these. Interesting. I kind of always thought that whenever they introduced steel type, that Blastoise kind of fit the description of getting it. Oh my god, <laughs> Blasters ahoy! Damn, this guy got. He's actually the same shape. Okay, this has got to be like a reference shape, unless this is all the same artist doing different things. This has got to be like a reference. He must have like a mega or a commonly known fan mega, right? I'm going to have to look into that. All right, Charizard, show us what... Oh, You're both really cool looking. Okay. I'm into it. Oh, that purple coloration actually looks really nice on this. What color was he before? Red. Red also looks fucking amazing. And in fact, I think the red is actually a little bit better than the purple. I think it's because the purple kind of bleeds into the black color. But that is really cool. All right, let's see the reverse. This one looks like he's got like a little flamethrower hand. Oh, he does. Of course, of course he does. Ooh, he kind of also looks like Mewtwo in a way. Did Mewtwo come from Sizor and Charizard do day instead of like Mew? They couldn't find a Mew, so they just improvised with Charizard and and uh, Sizor. I think that I think that's canon now. I have I have some degree of control over the Pokemon canon, right? Ooh, wow! Oh, okay. I was waiting for it to start. I had to push the button. <laughs> Look at his face. He's got he's kind of got the um the Steelix head going. Oh, I like that. Wow. <laughs> That's good. What is this? <gasps> oh, that is really cool. I didn't expect the scissor hands to be or the claw of the pincers to be on its back like the flower. That is so cool. I was expecting like a bunch of like Blades or something, which I guess he kind of has, which are, those are the wings actually. But I was expecting, like, I don't know, some kind of lawnmower. <laughs> I don't fucking know what I was expecting. Jesus. That was stupid. A lawnmower. All right. Blastoise and Steelix. Ooh. Oh no. I can already see where it is going. A literal, just bunch of cannons on this guy. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, fire, you won't miss. It's impossible to miss with this one. <laughs> okay. I do like this coloration, though. Damn. They both have really nice colors. Um, I think I'll go with the default. I like that blue, though. I do like the shell, the shell texture. All right. Give us your secondary form, fusion. <laughs> <laughs> they just stuck his head on in there. That is not going back in that shell, my dude. All right. Oh, you know what? I didn't think about this, but Charizard probably would have... Oh, my God. Melted the steel typing, right? Melted the steel right out of him. <laughs> oh, no. That is exactly what it looked like in the silhouette. Okay. That's fun. <laughs> just big-headed Charizard. Like a uh, dragon, uh, Chinese dragon. I don't actually know what they're actually called. Worms, something. I don't remember. All right, let's see what this big guy is. He's got a pretty cool shape, though. Pro so far, pro. What the fuck? Is that like a hammer? Steezard. Oh my god, that is. Upsetting. This is so fucking cool. Like, it looks like he took it's like the Tinkaton line with fucking Charizard and Steelix. Damn, look at this one. This one kind of makes me think of um Greymon, right? Metal Greymon? Is it Metal Greymon? Well, there's also other ones that just kind of follow that trend. This one makes me think of, like, the Greymon line. I like these a lot. Wow. 
All right, back to Venusaur. Oh, we've already seen one. <laughs> I remember this one, but I do not remember this one at all. Where did it? Jawline. Oh my God, when did I see this? That's so funny. Okay. Okay, that's, that's the reversal of the other one. Wait, no, it's not. Wait a minute. No, it's not. I'm thinking of Sizor. Sizor had the big head on the Sizor's body, not the right. Okay, never mind. I don't know. I'm stupid. All right, let's finish this part off with Parasect. Uh, I probably forgot or missed one, and I apologize for that. Uh, we can always come back to these, do more of these. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. That's not a happy day. That is disturbing. That is alien. <laughs> it's also kind of upsetting. Like, you know it just waits there. It turns, lays down flat on the ground and waits for you to come. Oh my god, these are both so horrific and I love them both. This guy's just a doofus. <laughs> Alright, uh... I'm gonna go with this one. Can't pick. My gotta go with the default. All right, and for the final, 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 final part of the video, uh, I got some Pokemon here that I thought, what if they were still tied? And as a conductor, the only Pokemon in this game that is pure steel type, a lot aside from the Clean Clang line, that's in the game. But I thought those were going to be two robot cyberpunk. We'll do that in a different video. We'll do like the Mecha video later. <laughs> so. It also kind of looks like the steel coat, doesn't it? Yeah, maybe. Uh, we're gonna use Reggie Steel, and we're gonna steel coat up some Pokemon. Ooh, I kind of assumed this was gonna turn into like a a missile, a rocket of some kind, because he's already like a torpedo. That would be so cool. Oh, that is scary! <laughs> wow, the Iron Brutal Pokemon. Damn. That is something really cool that they could have done, is give him the Steel Coat Evolve evolution. They they really underutilized the Steel Coat, I think. Just, it felt like such a weird throwaway thing. Only two Pokemon? Whoa! That sounds like a fucking Transformer if I've ever heard one. <laughs> God damn! These are horrifying. Okay, that one less so. Uh, okay. Uh, I just realized that my uh, my model stopped moving at some point in this video. So if I've been staring like this for a long time, I apologize. Uh, unfortunately, my, my head motions get a little crazy. So let me fix that real quick. Okay, well, I couldn't get the camera to quite pick that back up. So um, we're gonna continue just staring uh, blankly into the distance. Uh, one day, I'm going to upgrade and get an actual camera. I'm using my phone. It doesn't connect too well. So <laughs> we'll, we'll get this fixed eventually. Uh, so uh, let's continue on with our metal coats. Tyrantrum. You could use a, dry, a metal coat. Oh, we've already seen this one. So this one actually we saw, and I assumed it was like a Zoid or a Void or whatever. A Zoid? Are these Zoids? I can't remember. I made the same mistake in the video. But this one was actually from Horizon. I don't remember what they were called. So let's go ahead and see the other one. Oh my god. He's oh, that's creepy. He he's like the uh dragon Reggie. Reggie Dragon? Reggie Draco. Oh my god, that's actually a really cool one. If it weren't for like the poor like placement of all the parts. That could have been really cool. Uh, auto generator for an almost win. Uh, I kind of like the extra arm coming out. It adds a little bit more to the 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 the, the, the format the form. All right, so we're gonna try out Nitto King and Nitto Queen next. These two, oh, I feel like they deserve some more recognition in the game, right? Did they not get megas or anything? <laughs> I don't like this. 
this? Why did it go so weird? <laughs> it just get progressively worse. So many di So many different models to choose from. <laughs> Which one do we want? I think I think we got to pick this one. It's got some of the best of all parts, right? The bulging eyes. We're going to go this route. <laughs> the <laughs> oh no, my gut hurts. Oh, I wasn't expecting that horror show. All right, Nitto Queen, what what are you gonna do? Please don't do that. What the fuck is this? What is the shape? <laughs> what is? I can't remember the name of the album. Oh my god, I'll put it on screen if I can remember what it was. Jeez, that's a fun reference, though. Why? Oh, because it's quick. Just end the video. That That's... I, I'm so stupid. Okay, I had a timeout. I was being stupid. Uh, let's see Beedrill if it was actually... Oh, a Steel-type Pokemon. If it got actual Steel Code Evolution. Maybe. <laughs> this is more of a Reggie B. It's actually B still. I'm sorry. B still. Ooh, that's creepy. When it comes into your home at night. B still. And it just slowly inserts a stinger into your forehead. Ooh, that one's... I don't know why the auto generator wants to slap that face and make it like this weird armor, but it does, and it actually is kind of fun. Okay, so then we got uh, this one's kind of cute. If it weren't for the weird needly limbs, and then we got the recolors. Uh, I like this orange one a little bit. <laughs> just be still and just God, that's the last thing you want to hear. All right, let's see the reversal. Ooh, this one looks like he's got, whoa, that could have been what we got. That could have been really cool as like an official Pokemon. What the fuck? Wow, what the fuck? <laughs> Look at this guy. That kind of looks like the, uh, the other one we saw with the Tyrantrum. Is this also a Horizon creature that I, I didn't play uh, Horizon, so I don't actually know. But I love this one. This one is so good. And just because Gardevoir is good for, you know, a good... Oh. That looks pretty cool. I like the arm shape. Oh, okay. This is pretty cool. What is this? Holy shit. These are really cool. Um, These feel like references to something. I, I couldn't tell you what, though. So let me know if, uh, if you know what they were. And I will feel stupid when you do because I knew it and I didn't think of it. Uh, all right, last one. The last ones with Mill Tank were not pleasant to exist. Oh, I have a bad feeling about these. I have such a bad feeling about these. Oh, is it? Is it making ice cream? Oh, I just saw its cute little happy face. Oh my god, that is adorable. I like this. This is happy. This is a good one. Oh, that is so cool. I love that it makes ice cream. It's just a big machine. It's just a big ice cream dispenser. It's... <laughs> then you get the fucking bee still coming in and dripping honey on it. There you go. Oh, you know what? But it also... It's also a bit unsettling. The face looks too human. I think if it had like a, a LED space, it would be better. It would be less, it would be more appropriate for me. All right, let's see what this horror show is. 
what the fuck? What is it? It's got a cowbell. Oh, he's he's Iron Moo. Right? Is that what is that the future Pokemon? Uh the future paradox of Miltank Iron Moo? Or uh something milk? I wouldn't name it anything milk, but whatever. <laughs> All right, there we go. We have now seen some good old fusions of fusion. Why, why did I buy it? I put so much stress on the F there. Uh, some really good fusions or maybe some potential metal coat evolutions. Uh, next time, we're going to be continuing on like these kind of weird themes. Uh, maybe we'll do the mecha thing. Maybe we'll do robots. Maybe something else. Uh, always open to, I'm always open to suggestions. Uh, I read them. I may not always respond because I'm bad at doing responses, but I, I do read every comment. So <laughs> thank you so much. And thank you again for this suggestion. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Bye.